Hey, look who's finally awake. Brain, legs, arms, eyes. All important vital functions for puzzle solving appear to be intact. Splendid. I can imagine you must be feeling a bit disoriented, waking up in this strange yet exhilarating place. Please do not panic when I reveal this truth to you. You are a mortal, an insignificant being from Earth. I apologize for the harsh reality. However, a no time for self-pity. As fate would have it, today is your lucky day. <laughs> you have been chosen by none other than me, the mighty Tobla, the one and only puzzle architecton responsible for the trials of the gods. I require your assistance in testing my latest collection of puzzles. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. One step at a time, Mort. All right, let's kick things off with a simple task, shall we? We wouldn't want to strain your little mind too much. Just grab that cube and place it onto the pressure plate on the floor. I know your kind simply adores these elementary logic puzzles. Piece of cake, right? You've got this, Mort. done, Mort. <sighs> this button has activated a materializer that can, well, materialize a specific object. <laughs> I won't bother you with the technicalities. Just remember, it's the same old object that appears each time, not an additional new one. Got it? Your puzzle-solving abilities are right on par with my expectations. Splendid. Now that those sweet brain cells of yours are starting to fire up, we can move on to the intriguing part. Notice that pedestal over there? Go ahead and grab that delightful glowy thing perched on top of it. always cherish this moment. It must have felt absolutely marvelous, like being reborn on an entirely new level. Oh, the sheer surge of cosmic energy coursing through your veins, awakening every inch of your being. <sighs> By claiming that item from the pedestal, you have become infused with a tiny fragment of godly power, <laughs> which shall prove immensely useful on the path that lies before us. All right, let's put your newfound ability to use right away. Aim at the small- First swap successful. Oh, that's splendid, Mort. It must feel like magic to you. One moment the objects are there, and then poof, they've changed their positions. <laughs> oh. Can you spot that glowing archway? That is the first of many cosmic portals you'll come across. Your primary objective in each puzzle is to utilize these portals to advance to the next area. Sounds pretty simple, doesn't it? So far, so good! <laughs> Welcome to the awe-inspiring Room of Transition. A mystical chamber that serves as the gateway between two puzzle areas. <laughs> Here, you can take a moment to collect your thoughts as the portal to the next area charges up. It's a brief respite, a uh, calm before the storm of mind-bending challenges that await you. Embrace this interlude and prepare yourself for the thrilling journey ahead.
I can see you, Mort. <laughs> seem to be getting the hang of it. Splendid. I will take a back seat from now on, silently observing your every move. Surprise! You cannot shoot through those barriers. They have been designed to prevent solutions that would be too simple or straightforward. It's a basic principle of puzzle design. Nothing special, you know. <laughs> However, you are more than welcome to walk through them. Don't be shy. Ah, there you are, Mort. <laughs> this whole puzzle collection started as a commission for the goddess of space distortion and has become a passion project of mine. <laughs> it's just one small part of the big trial bubble we live in, though. These days, the gods are in a trial frenzy. Trials for loyalty, as punishment, simply to ward off boredom, you name it. <sighs> Unfortunately, everyone tends to forget that puzzle creation is hard and takes a lot of time and eye for detail. <sighs> Sometimes a little more appreciation would be welcome. <laughs> oh well. Open Saffron! Uh, or, or was it Sage? Something like that. <laughs> uh, the phrase you mortals use when a uh, thing magically opens? What is it? Hey, want to hear something funny? How many mortals does it take to populate Mars? You ready? <laughs> Trick question. They would all be dead before it could even happen. <laughs> oh, it gets me every time.
I'm sure you're eager to know more about Mighty Tobla's wildest puzzle commissions of all time, aren't you? Of course you are. Let me think. Ah, there was the trial of invisibility where everyone died and no one noticed. Hmm. Zeus's thunder trial, which required so much electricity that it caused a massive divine power outage. Oh, that was a good one. <laughs> ah, I've got it. My top pick would be the infamous donut trial. <laughs> I mean, have you ever considered how incredibly challenging it is to create 50 puzzles solely centered around donuts? <laughs> Not to mention that the god of biscuits forbade me from using his sacred dessert in any manner he deemed inappropriate. <sighs> the unique selling point wears off quickly if you don't have a few tricks up your sleeve. special type of barrier just erase your swap marks when you touched it? <laughs> How mischievous. What a devious creation. <laughs> I thoroughly enjoy shattering your expectations with my puzzles. Let's see how you handle word riddles, Mort. If you kill me, I will die. If you don't, I still will die. What am I? I think you already know the answer. <laughs> hmm.
how time flies. The end of our test is already drawing near. Has anyone ever told you that you're such a good listener? <laughs> it's a shame that I have to get rid of you after this. Although it is the fate of every mortal, death is a very unpleasant experience. I... <clears throat> Did, did, did I say death? <laughs> yes, I meant death, exactly. Uh, don't worry, death doesn't mean the same thing to us as it does to you. It describes the uh, process of bringing you back to the mortal realm. It's not about dying, it's about coming home. <laughs> Thank you.
that death thing again? <laughs> Did you really think the mighty Toblo would try to harm you? Silly Mort. I could never do that. No, not me. I'm as harmless as a little bee. I mean, if I were to kill every one of my testers, how would I sleep at night? <laughs> I, if I even needed to sleep at all. <laughs> Poor choice of words. Um, let's forget about it. <laughs> The weather here is splendid today, isn't it? <sighs> uh, okay, okay, it's always the same, but still, splendid. You could at least say something, anything. I'm just trying to make conversation here. By the way, 
This is the last puzzle of the test, if that's still of any interest to you. I can't do this anymore. Listen, I am a terrible liar. That thing about death not meaning literal death in our realm wasn't true. You really do have to die after this, so you can't reveal any details about the puzzle trials to your little mortal friends. I'm sorry I lied. But you would have been forced to complete the test anyway. It saved us a lot of unnecessary human emotion. Trust me. <sighs> Let's not make this harder than it has to be, Mort. On the other side of that portal, you'll find a fate that most humans can only dream of. Please take it. Here we are. The fate that every mortal can only dream of is, of course, to die a heroic death. <laughs> I mean, what better place to achieve this than in the soul-melting trials of the underworld, right? <sighs> These puzzles are filled with deadly dangers just waiting for you to go out with a bang. An honorable farewell, wouldn't you agree? Well. This is about as honorable as it gets. Oh, don't worry. There are worse ways to die than being grilled.
don't worry. There are worse... Mort, listen. I don't want to lie to you again, so... Full disclosure here. There is an ancient portal at the end of this area that could... Theoretically, take you back home. It was once used to send mortals to the underworld for their punishment, and... Now, it mostly collects dust. But there is literally no way for you to get there. I'm only telling you this because... If I'm being kind and i want you to have something to look forward to even in the face of inevitable death activities is undeniably fun, but the task of rebuilding each time can be quite tedious. Maybe it wasn't such a good idea to tell you the truth about the portal. Even though I assured you that there was no way that you could reach it, I can see a glimmer of hope in your eyes. <sighs> Humans always tend to hear what they want to hear, and not what is actually being said. Now, let me be very clear. Can you please die in the next puzzle? I am on a tight schedule, and would like to wrap things up soon. It would be most unfortunate if you got too attached to the idea of surviving. Oh, don't worry. There are worse ways to die. I've tried to be nice and friendly, but if you won't listen, we'll have to do this the hard way. 
Did you really think you could escape with the power you borrowed from me like it was nothing? Remember who is the boss in this constellation. None other than me, the mighty Tobla. I will shut down the portal to Earth before you even get there. The next puzzles will give me plenty of time to do that. Then this ridiculous ego trip of yours will be over. Mortal. Hypothetically, if you were to leave our realm with that power, which will not happen as long as I am able to stop you, but only hypothetically, it would be the end of me. I could lose my job and my reputation. You would destroy my whole existence. I would be far from splendid. You wouldn't want that for the mighty Tobla, would you? Right, Mort? Right?
Thank you for your service to the mighty Tobla! <laughs>
Why is this damn portal still not completely shut down? What did those useless engineers do with their last firmware update? <sighs> you can never trust ancient technology when things are about to get rough. <sighs> all right. It seems that this will all culminate in a final showdown between you and me. Well, this is the moment, Mort. I can't believe how it's all turned out. The only thing standing between you and your journey home is me. I won't let you escape with this power and disrupt the balance between our realms. And let's not forget about my own demise. <laughs> I will make sure no one speaks of you, sings your praises, or records your name or deeds. You will be forgotten for all eternity. Using my own weapons against me will save you from my wrath? <laughs> Pathetic. My favorite eyes, you son of a mortal! Don't get your hopes up too high. We're far from finished here, Mort. All right. 
Let's proceed with a simple task, shall we? Just grab that cube and... Piece of cake, right? You've got this, Mort. <laughs> Let this be a lesson to any mortal who dares to challenge the mighty tome. All right. Let's proceed with a simple task, shall we? Just grab that cube and... You know exactly what to do. Piece of cake, right? You've got this, Mort. You survived. Well, of course you did. After all, it was just another elementary logic puzzle. <laughs> Speaking of our beloved puzzles, I have another one for you. What is round has spikes and comes in large numbers. Correct. More bombs. <laughs> enough. All right, Mort. You win. <coughs> Nothing can stop you from using the portal now. But before you go, let me share a few parting thoughts. 
With this stolen power, you no longer truly belong in the realm of humanity. Your people won't accept you. They'll fear you. And you can't even use this ridiculous ability to make their world a better place. <laughs> Simply swapping things around doesn't solve real problems. <laughs> oh, that makes me feel a little better about my defeat. What are you waiting for? Embrace the bitter sweetness of your fate.